It is Monday morning, which means I am six days post-op. Looks like an ear with cotton in it, right? Um, so yeah, six days ago, we had a left acicular chain reconstruction. Um, I don't know how to describe what it sounds like. I definitely hear more. Uh, not a lot of pain, only a tiny bit of blood coming out now. Um, which I might notice, like one cotton ball a day, I change it a couple times a day. Um, I notice a lot of low pitched sounds. Like I very much notice the fact that our Suburbans of E8, I notice, you know, motors and things that I never noticed before. It's sometimes overwhelming, it takes a while to really wrap my head around it. Um, and I notice things like you know, I was calling my wife's phone so she could find the phone that she lost again. And I put my phone up to my good ear and then I was like, well, I'm curious what the ringing sounds like on my left ear. And even through all the packing, it's very close to the same volume or even better in my left ear. So I'm curious what happens once it's all the way done healing and we get the packing out, which will fall out slowly on its own, which I'm not excited for. Um, I enjoy the part where they pull that long string of packing out, but that's because I'm weird. Anyways, we're six days post-op, things seem to be hearing better. Uh, I took a week pretty much entirely off work except for a couple of meetings. And this week I'm excited to get back at it. Um, planning to take the full week off and just chill is really worthwhile. I did a bunch of little projects around the house, but if you're having the same, you know, torp or porp surgery, uh, plan for a week off just to let yourself recharge. Other than that, no nausea, no ringing, just kind of full. I'm even actually, I'm probably only taking an Advil or a Tramadol, you know, every day or second day, and usually just right before bed, because if it's uncomfortable, it's harder to go to sleep. Other than that, things are groovy. I'll do another update probably midweek or this time next week, because um, I have heard from a couple people who have had the same surgery or have had a cholesteatoma and are thinking about it. So yeah, in the meantime, Go get your hearing tested.